In today's video, we're diving into everything you need to know about a bad timing belt or timing chain. So, what's the purpose of the timing belt or timing chain? Its job is to synchronize the rotation of the crankshaft and camshaft. This perfect synchronization ensures that the camshafts open the intake and exhaust valves at just the right time, depending on the position of the pistons. In some cases, it also drives other components like the water pump, oil pump, and balance shafts. The timing belt is usually located under the hood, either on the left or right side of the engine, depending on the car's design. It's protected by a timing cover to keep it safe from debris. Now that we know what the timing belt does, let's dive into the symptoms of a bad timing belt. While a check engine light can indicate various problems, one of them could be a failing timing belt. This happens because the engine control unit, ECU, detects issues related to engine timing and triggers relevant fault codes. Here are some OBD2 codes related to a bad timing belt. If you're not sure about what these OBD2 codes mean, you can always visit our website, obdcode.org, where we've got a full list of codes and their explanations. I'll also put a link down below if you need an OBD2 scanner, or you can head to any auto parts store and scan your car for free. Now you can still have a bad timing chain or belt with no check engine light, so let's move on to the next symptom. Symptom two, rattling, knocking, or clattering noise. If you hear unusual sounds while the car is running, it could be due to a loose or worn out timing chain. A loose timing chain can smack against the timing cover, causing a rattling, knocking, or clattering noise. This noise is often more noticeable during startup or at idle. On most cars, the timing belt should not exceed more than half an inch of stretch. If it does, it's a good indication that it's time for a replacement. Make sure to get the correct timing belt or chain for your car's make and model. You can find the right timing belt or chain through the link in the description below. Symptom 3. Poor Performance a stretched timing belt or chain can cause the camshaft to rotate out of sync with the crankshaft, which affects the timing of valve opening and closing. As a result, your engine may lose power, and you could experience poor performance, such as sluggish acceleration, misfires, or a rough idle. Symptom 4. Fast crank, but no start. A loose or broken timing belt can fail to properly transmit power to the camshaft and other components like the water pump and oil pump. When this happens, the crankshaft spins faster because there's less resistance, resulting in a fast cranking sound when you try to start the car, but the engine won't actually fire up. If you found this video helpful, please give it a thumbs up, share it with fellow automotive enthusiasts, and subscribe to our channel for more in-depth automotive diagnostics and repair guides. Don't forget to hit the bell icon to get notified of our upcoming videos.